Hi everybody, it's Tina and I um, am an astrologer as well as a numerologist. And I wanted to let everybody know that I'm gonna do a short series on tantric numerology. <clears throat> and this year is a really special year, not only in tantric numerology, but also in Chinese numerology. It's the year of the dragon, so February 10th, is the Chinese New Year and we come into the year of the dragon. So what does that mean for you? If you look at the year overall, the numerology is an eight. So if you take two, I know this is backwards, but two, zero, two, four, it equals eight. You just add the numbers across. So it's an eight year in tantric numerology and it's the year of the wood dragon. So we are closing out a 12 year and also a 60 year cycle. So many of you probably aren't older than 60, but if you are, you're closing out that cycle. So the last time we had a year of the wood dragon was um, 1964. So that's the 60 year cycle. So those that were born in 1964 were born in a wood dragon year. And you can easily find out you just type in the year that you were born and Chinese astrology, and then you might be like a fire horse or a water dragon or all sorts of um, an earth rabbit. It could be tons of different things that, that you could be. So let's talk about a little bit about the year of the dragon. So dragons are amazing. And the last time we were in the year of a dragon was 12 years ago. That's the 12 year cycle. And that was a water dragon. And if you think of the qualities of a dragon, the dragon can be fierce and scary, or it can be, there's many dragon teachings. I do dragon teachings in um, the light body yoga school that I, that I teach. Um, dragons can be very nurturing and, and um, mystical and great teachers and fearless and leaders and we live on a dragon planet for those of you that follow any of the dragon teachings so the water dragon was more like a nurturing dragon so think about 2012 what happened to you in 2012 a lot for a lot of us it was the awakening and sometimes the awakening was this ah, amazing moment but for most of us it was a real like transition a time where we said this isn't working for me anymore and something has to change and it could have been as a result of an illness or a job you needed to quit or a relationship that was no longer working for you but whatever it was it started you on the path to your awakening journey and so now you look back over those past 12 years and we're taking all of the learnings from the water dragon that was kind of holding you through this transformation process for the last 12 years. And that the wood dragon is now going to help you ground all of those things into the earth. All of the things that you learned, all of the teachings, everything that you brought into your life since 2012, you're now gonna integrate it in the year of the wood dragon. Okay, so in the next video, I'm going to talk about how to calculate your own personal astrology. I'm sorry, your personal numerology. <laughs> I do astrology too. Okay, thanks.